Alright, what's up everybody? Welcome to Fallout 4's modded playthrough, long awaited. It's finally here. We're gonna get started. You can see I've made a female character. And she's obviously a little uh, starved of food for now, but as we progress through this modded playthrough, you can see there's there's the Ode to Boris. Somebody made that mod for me a long time ago. So dog meat looks like a Rottweiler. So that's my memorial of Boris right there. And we're gonna run through, I've got 22 mods loaded right now. Some of them will be visible, as you can see as we move around. Some of them will have to go find stuff. Um, some of it will be built, have to be built along the way, crafted, all kinds of things. And I will probably be adjusting as we go, probably adding. Uh, I don't know about taking any away right now, but I don't... I haven't gone any farther than this. This is it. I've come to Sanctuary. It's, uh, I'm like level one or just barely in a level two because I cleared some stuff, made a bed. But here we go, you guys long awaited. This is at least a year overdue, if not two years. <laughs> it might be one full year overdue. All right, so that being said, let's uh, let's get it going. Let's get a move on, all right? So I haven't done any like, you know, big cleanup around here you can see, but if you can see the trees, you'll be able to see the grass and stuff is different. Um, normally you can see all through here. So it's going to be a completely different look. Haven't done any ENBs or anything like that yet. I wanted to get to playing. I wanted to start playing. I can always adjust things as I go. But the one major thing I like is the addition of all these trees and the leaves. I mean, whoa, like that tree. Is that normally there? <laughs> Look at how much different the whole game looks already, you guys. All right, so our mission, I believe, is to go into Cambridge. Um, let's see, out of time. Codsworth, talk to Codsworth. We did that. We did that. Investigate Concord. Oh, that's what. It, that's right. Go into Concord, right? That's what we're doing. Investigating. All right. This should be super duper fun. Just, I mean, oh, so far I love the look of it. I haven't gone any farther than right here. I mean, I, I did, before I loaded the mods, I actually walked up up here just past the gas station. Because the mods weren't working for me originally. Um, and it turned out I had to run my mod uh, manager, my Nexus mod manager, as administrator. And then they all loaded. Like, they were all in there, but they all the files were empty, so... That was interesting. Took me a little while to figure that out, but it's looking really good so far. What I want to do is one of the places that we're, we need to go after investigating Concord is there's a cemetery just past it. There's supposed to be my first set of uh, like leather. I named this this lady the Black Widow, and there's some Black Widow armor up there, I believe. And there's supposed to be the Widowmaker shotgun somewhere in town. Now I said Cambridge originally because I loaded a mod called um, Cambridge Player Home. So I'm gonna check that out, see if I like that. Wow, it looks so different just coming in here. The whole map looks different already. And then I've also got something called Conquest where it's gonna let me set up like uh, campfires and tents along the way as a kind of a temporary base. And then if I want to, I can expand on that and make it like a player home slash settlement, which is crazy, because that means I could almost put it anywhere that I want. All right, we found Concord. All right, so we may have the return of Iron Bowling Ball, but we don't know yet. That's the beauty of this. That's the beauty of the modded playthrough. Oh, I can't wait to get into some, some serious action. So I've got this, the regular pistol, I've also got uh, a short double barrel, and that's it. Okay, I hear the gun fire. There's so many mods, you guys, to choose from. I went through, and it was crazy. That's why I'm starting with 22. 22 mods! That's a raider. 
test this out right from the beginning. Come on, baby! Get it! Get her! Dog meat, Boris! Oh! 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 That's a mauling! That's a mauling! Oh my god. Alright, so you guys, what was it? There was something else. Oh! I am. I just I just squeaked into level two, okay? I just squeaked into level two, and my first point that I picked <laughs> was You guessed it, idiot savant. <laughs> I just love when he does that so much, so I picked that first. I don't even care. So we get one of them to me. That's got a little burst action. Now I'm gonna do some obviously custom weapons and stuff, but oh, it feels so good to be back playing. I haven't played Fallout since since Iron Bowling Ball days. Oh yeah, mow him! Yeah, I start collecting some goods. Okay, I'm just gonna start click. What the? Okay, apparently the Raiders have, uh, see, so yeah. All right, is this a girl? Apparently, oh, okay. So that's a thing. <laughs> apparently lace underwear has come into fashion in the wasteland. Oh, that's a hit marker. Come on, shotgun. Get him, dog meat! Did you see the blood come off that? So I'm gonna grab everything for now until I get encumbered and then we'll start dumping. Um, you guys are interested in what I look like? Uh, let's just um, do a quick peek of what, what I look like. Um, so yeah, that's me. I'm a very attractive young lady. <laughs> you thought I looked a little skinny, but all right, here we go. Hey, up here on the balcony. Yeah, I see you. Group of settlers inside. The raiders are almost through the door. Grab that laser musket and help us, please. This laser musket. Out of time, completo. All right, so I'm gonna put that laser musket on. My weapons for me. Fragmentation grenade, hardened pistol, short laser musket. Might as well try to use it. Oh, I put. Oh, two, three. All right, four. That's right. Number one is my my stim packs. There we go. <laughs> Hold tab to open perk chart. You've reached level three. All right, so. Do we do idiot? Can we do idiot savant again? What does it require? Luck 11. Oh, jeez. So we should start raising some luck. I just really like that one. Auto saving. When freedom calls. When freedom calls. We're coming inside. It's been years since this part of the game I actually got to play. You know, it took me, what, six, eight months to play through the game? Hope to reload and charge it up. Yeah, how did that feel? I don't even remember, it's so good. You know, when you don't play it for a long time, it's really good because it feels new again. Burn to occupation. Oh, 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 sorry. <laughs> Grab your team and run it out. All right, we're doing super sneaky mode. Now, if I remember right, there's a. You're on that corner. Dude. That's a headshot. There's a... 
Let's see. Let's see if this mod works. I'm gonna say... I'm gonna say it's trail. What do you guys think? Hacking. Select a potential password with mouse one. You should incorrect it. I'm gonna say it's trail. Oh! <laughs> it's, uh, it's with the girl's voice now. It's so different. Hey, wait a minute. Hold on. I thought I just unlocked it. I didn't hit unlock. Derp. So one of the mods is is uh, easy hacking. So we don't have to play the hacking game. Meaty, how do you get all those fusion cores? What? We're not even 10 minutes into the game. I got a fusion core. <laughs> oh, you guys. You're so easy to troll. You're so easy to troll. Get that laser rifle out again. Can we double double it up? Just once. Are they up a level? Sounds like they're up a level. Oh, she's shooting at him. Oh yeah, they're definitely up a level. You gotta start you gotta start collecting the goods and services, you guys. <laughs> Wee -hoo -hoo. What happened, little fella? Okay. We don't Good thing that the guys don't have the underwear on, right? Man, I miss this game so much. Super good to be back in here. Okay. What I'm trying to do is to mod it in a way where it's still going to be fun and everything without it being um, OP on the mods, you know what I mean? But I still want to get some decent guns in here. Like, I saw some scars. I saw. There's an ultimate weapon thing, but I'm not going to do that. I want to do like some. Some specialty type weapons, like a like an M4 or a Scar, or something like that. Oh, hit the voice! I gotta change that voice. <laughs> it's not the same as the. <laughs> oh my god, that is cracking me up. Where'd that dude go? Short barreled shotgun plus. Oh no. man, come back! What'd you say? That ammo. Thank you. Oh man, come back! We and I'm gonna skin every last one of you. Get some motherfucker! What did he just say I'll to me? I do. Get him, dog meat! What did he just... No, stop shooting the dog! Stop knifing the dog, dude! What the... Did you see that shot? It was two feet over his head! This thing... Stop stabbing the dog! Bite his throat out! Yeah. Teach him to stab you, huh? Switchblade. Rude. Pipe pistol. That was totally rude. I had to switch weapons. That one, I couldn't take it. Couldn't take the pressure. Duffel bag. Short pipe revolver. What's up, man? We've made it. Hi. Man, I don't know who you are, but your time is impeccable. I'm, I'm Black Widow. Preston Garvey. Call Meaty me Minute the Black Man. Widow. Minutemen? Minutemen? So now I'm traveling backward in time. Protect the people at a minute's notice. Huh. That was the idea. Ah, that so idea. I joined up, wanted to make a difference. Yeah, and I did, but things fell apart. Now it looks like I'm the last Minuteman left standing. Maybe. Please, go on. Nope. A month ago, there were 20 of us. 
Yesterday there were eight. Now we're five. First it was the ghouls in Lexington, and now this mess. Sorry. Sounds really rough. Thanks. Maybe... Thanks. It's good to meet someone who nope. really cares. Anyway, we figured Concord would be a safe place to settle. Those raiders proved us wrong. But, well, we do have one idea. One good idea can make all the difference. Sturgis, tell her. There's a crashed vertebrate up on the roof. Old school, pre-war. You might have seen it. Well, looks like one of its passengers left behind a seriously sweet goodie. We're talking a full suit of cherry T-45 power armor. Yeah! Military issue. I like it. I like it. <laughs> yeah, I thought you might. Protection with an added bonus. Get the suit. You can rip the minigun right off the vertibird. <laughs> Do that, and those raiders get an express ticket to hell. You dig? I dig. Minigun. <laughs> now we're talking. I know, right? Only there's one hitch. The suit's out of juice. Probably been dry for a hundred years. It can be powered up again. But we're a bit stuck. I'll help if I can. What you'll need is an old pre-war FC. A standardized fusion core. Hmm. Your Seem to have one of those. long-term nuclear battery used by the military and some companies way back when. And we know right where to find one. But we can't get to the damn thing. It's down in the basement. I've hacked it already. Locked behind a security gate. Look, I fix stuff. I tinker. Bypassing security ain't exactly my forte. You could give it a shot. I already have it, son. Actually, I already grabbed the fusion core. We're set. Well, all right. Maybe our luck's finally turning around. Once you jack the core into the power armor and grab that minigun, those raiders will know they picked the wrong fight. Good luck. All right, Preston Garvey. Get out my face! Give me a suit already! Careful, kid. What? Perception, bobblehead. Quick. <laughs> Coming. Oh, I am not talking to her. She is just south of annoying. Just south of annoying. We're going on the roof. We're going on the roof. You know. I didn't tell you guys that in my my original playthrough of this game, you know, I did the whole Minuteman thing and went around and did all that stuff, which was fun. But after the fact, they kept calling on me. I'm like, dude, I put turrets at all your guys' locations. What do you need my help for? Quit calling me. I'm on a job, right? On a job. Hey, oh, it's getting attacked. It's getting attacked. <coughs> Dog found something. What the? What'd you find? This? <coughs> this? These? What did you find? This? Oh yeah. <clears throat> How do you find so many fusion cores? Grab said minigun, please. It's a perfect fit. This thing's rusty, man. This is nothing like my own. Power armor reduces incoming damage, prevents damage from falling. Oh, roger that. Up here. Boss! We got somebody up here! <laughs> Why don't you get down here? Show me that fancy gun up We've close. Company. Not a lot of here. Give you that. Do it. Yeah. Get out my face. Oh, Needy's back. The black. What? Ah, oh, that car's gonna explode. See ya. No, dog meat! No, dog meat! Your dog's in trouble. Dog meat! No, don't try and fight the big thing! There, you like that, Deathclaw? Huh? 
Huh? You feeling it? You feeling it? Where'd he go? Look at him back there. Dog meat, chill. You just chill. Wait, why does the death call look smaller now than Eat lead! <laughs> oh, my leg! My leg! <laughs> oh, somebody's hurt. Yeah, it's a minigun, alright! You didn't need to talk about the suit. Uh, both my legs are broken, apparently. You okay, little buddy? Huh, little fella? And you, evil, evil thingy. Eh, some death claw meat. Might be hungry later on. All right, the core is only at fifty percent. Need to figure out how to get more fusion cores. <laughs> Come on, let's go. We cleared these fools already. I'll take your am. Oh, what happened to your leg, lady? What happened to your leg? Corvega storage key. Corvega storage key. Okay, that could be useful. Shotgun shell, stim pack. Now, somewhere in town. Oh, shoot. I'm going to have to look up. There's somewhere in town is where this double barrel shotgun is that I want. It's one of the mods. It's just a mod. It's like a skin mod, right? It's a skin mod. I'm gonna play the whole game in a power armor with a minigun. Iron bowling ball meets death machine. Death machine! Uh, I need to fix my legs. I need to fix my legs! Take it easy, mama. You okay? Fine, fine. Oh, you're welcome. Quit fussing. Preston? That was a pretty amazing display. I'm just glad you're on our side. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I'm on my side. I'm on my own side, Garvey. That's a shame. You can never have too many friends in the Commonwealth. Listen, when we first met, you asked about the Minutemen. One thing you should know about us, we help out our friends. Uh-huh. So here, for everything you've done, thank you. What'd you give me? A fusion cell? Did that say 50 fusion cells or 50 weight? You're welcome. You're welcome. Anytime. Well, since you say that, maybe you'll come to Sanctuary with us. We could use your help getting settled there. Okay, join Preston Garvey in Sanctuary. Fine! All right, Garvey. I'm in. I'll help oh, you. That's wonderful. I hate her. But there's more to your destiny, isn't there? I want to punch her right in the face. I've seen it. And I know your pain. Um. Destiny? My destiny? What do you mean? You are a woman out of time. Out of hope. But all is not lost. I can feel your son's energy. He's alive. Bullshit. <laughs> You're trying to play me for a fool. Oh, no, kid, no. The sight's sometimes foggy, but it ain't ever a liar. Your son's out there. And even I don't need the sight to tell you where you should start looking. The great green jewel of the Commonwealth. Mm. Diamond City. Diamond City. The biggest settlement around. All right, jewel of the city. Mama Murphy, I'm working from nothing. I need more. Look, kid. Uh -huh. Mama Murphy, we talked about this. That junk. It's gonna kill you. Oh, shush, Preston. We're all gonna hey. die eventually. Sounds like you better get going to Diamond We're City. We're gonna need the site. And our new friend here. Don't worry. She's gonna need it too. I'll get these now people to let's sanctuary. Get going. Sanctuary. Right. You get them to sanctuary. Why right, is it telling me I want to talk Thanks to, to our you. friend here? It's safe to move out. We're heading for that place Mama Murphy knows about. Sanctuary. It's not That's far. my place. She knows about it? You mean she had one of her visions while she was stoned out of her gourd. 
And now you want us to just head out hey. on another wild goose chase based on no better plan than Mama Murphy saw it? It can oh, hold on, hold on. Worse than... Everybody just take it easy. We're all in this together, right? So Marcy, you got a better idea of what we should do next? Anybody? Well then, sanctuary it is. Let's just hope it lives up to its name. Why don't you guys get a move on? It's time to go. Oh, okay. Sanctuary. So, if I remember correctly, you gotta go up there, probably set up a radio beacon, some defenses, and stuff like that. Hmm. But while I'm in town here, I need to find my, uh... I need to find my weapon. Okay, data. So we got this one. Jewel of the Commonwealth, go to Diamond City. So I don't have to yet go back and help them. Join Preston Garvey. That can be at any time. The Jewel of the Commonwealth. That's going to be just hoofing it. So we're going to have to do a little bit of cruising around. Wonder. No, you know what? I'm going to join him back there. Just so I can get rid of the power armor. Right? right I want to get lost. rid of the power armor. Let's head up there now. Let's see if our uh, fusion core that we have is enough. You guys just gonna walk really slow or what? Oh, shoot. What was that? What was that? First time I've seen one of these things up close. Oh, I, I walked over sandbags and exploded. Damage to the power armor piece can be repaired. That yeah, I know that. My legs are both broke. My, one of my arms is hurt. It's not my fault. That dude came out. The big bad guy. You guys need to get a move on, otherwise this power armor's gonna. Huh! I don't remember doing that before. Okay. We, I think we're gonna have enough. So there's some mods, some cool mods that I saw in there, you guys, that take some of these houses in some of the towns. Not all of them, just some of them. And gives you the ability to uh, put, you know, have interiors in them. So you can go in them, right? And it, I, it was crazy because all the places I talked about, uh, there was, there's a place, I don't know if I'm going to remember, but there's a place over here um, where the school is. Oh, I can't even remember. But anyway, it was one of them. Uh, down, down, there's the... Dude, you can't even see that with all the trees. I love it. So there's places everywhere that you can do the interiors for. That's why I kind of was thinking about doing that, but we'll see. Oh, yes. What happened to these guys? Uh, what happened to you, Drifter? Drifter. All right, we're going to go back and take off this power armor. Your power armor fusion core is low. Do you even know who I am? I am the fusion core king. When you're fusion core, you've been able to use vats or power attacks and will move at a reduced rate. Really? So you can still move in power armor when the fusion core is out? I didn't know that. I didn't know that. Hmm. Interesting. I was looking for a really good uh, player home. There's one that, that has... It's up here somewhere. It's a... Uh, like up over here I think and it's a like a sauna <laughs> it's like a sauna uh, I don't remember how to do this get out of it next to it so you block yourself in hit craft and exit it There. He's parked in there just fine. You'll be fine, little fella. Alright, what does it want me to... It probably wants me to build a... Um, probably wants me to build a... What did I say? The, um, the beacon, right? Let's see what it says. Let's see what it says. Data. When freedom calls, join Preston in the... Okay, yeah. Come on, Preston. Dude, you guys walk way too slow. Way too slow. 
I'm glad you decided to come with us. I didn't come I with you. I should have listened to Mama Murphy all along. Pretty nice place she's found for us. I think we could settle down here. Make it a place to call home. What do you think? Uh, I lived here. Yeah. I used to like living here. Before the war. What do you mean? Before what war? Are you saying... I lived here. Over 200 years ago. I, I was frozen or something for most of it. Just woke up a little while ago. Damn. Like one of those old pre-war ghouls. You say you were frozen. Anybody else make it out with you? Uh, I don't want to talk about it. I don't want to talk about it. No worries. We've all got our past to deal with. I don't need to know anything you don't want to tell me. Anyway, I am glad you're here. And I hope you don't mind, but I've got another favor to ask. Oh, great. I've had word from a settlement asking for help. They're still hoping there are Minutemen out there somewhere. The only chance to start rebuilding the Minuteman is to show people that they can count on us when they need us. Trouble is, I've got my hands full here. Do you think you could go help out the settlement? Sure. I'd be glad to help. That's fantastic. The Minuteman could use more people like you. By the way, if you want to help out around here at all, talk to Sturgis. I'm sure he'd be glad for all the help he can get. Okay. You reached level four in the first episode. Talk to the seller at Ten Pines Bluff. So, here's what we're gonna do. Here's what we're gonna do, you guys. I'm going to double check to see where to find that shotgun and the armor. We'll do that in the next episode. We'll go find that stuff so I can gear up a little bit. I'm gonna get rid of some inventory here and um, hey. we'll probably, eh, maybe we'll go help the people at Ten Pines, we'll see. We don't want to head all the way down to Diamond City yet. You know what I'm saying? All right, you guys, that's it for the first episode, Fallout 4 Modded. You guys, if you made it this far in the video, thank you very much for having the patience to follow along. Please consider hitting the like button. Leave me a comment down below and definitely join me in the next episode.